All right, man, torture talk. You know what it is, man. I'm back again, back again, baby. Back again in here. So look, look, man, this this Drake suing thing is going crazy right now. I ain't going to even hold y'all. You know what I'm saying? I had to drop another video because I'm like, all right, I seen something that WAC 100 was saying, and I got another video with WAC 100 uh, talking to somebody. Uh, um, <clears throat> um, yeah, so we're going to get into this video, though. Uh, WAC 100 is breaking down Drake's whole uh, whole uh, suing thing, and he's talking to a bunch of people on his, on his uh, show on Spaces, which is uh, pretty good. I'm probably going to jump on there one day and talk to him because I need to I need to I want to ask him for an interview and see if he'll come on my show. I'm sure he would. <clears throat> he's a real one. So look, we're going to get into this clip. Before well, I get into that, you know, this is Torch's Talk. If you like the content, please subscribe. And if you're new here, let me work on your description today. All the beautiful, sexy, single ladies put one in the chat. All the fellas, y'all know where to find the ones that just don't harass them. I don't sell no merch, but I do have content absolutely free. But if you want to leave a donation, it's in the description. Cash app. No more PayPal. They called me the Hidden Gem. I went from 1,300 subscribers to over 12,000 subscribers. And I'm the king of the north. You know what it is. Um, people ask me why why I don't wear the hats no more, cause I'm the king of the north now. That's it. This is it right here. This is it. You are gonna see me with this all the time. You know what I'm saying? Unless this joint break and I have to buy another one, but <clears throat> you definitely gonna see me with this. You might even see me on a plane with it on. So, all right. So look, we are gonna get to it. Let's go. Let's go, man. Stop playing around, nigga. Let's go. All right, man. So let's get it going, man. <laughs> <laughs> the dudes just keep coming, man. Oh my god, bro. This guy, yo, I'm telling you, man. Yeah, let's go, man. Cause I I, I got a theory. Let's I asked go. Siri to play the Drake song. It was playing not Certified like Lover Boy is Drake. Uh Certified no. Lover Boy is a bar. No, it's a bar. That's a, that's a bar. What's good, y'all? It's your boy the answer, man. You hear the discussion, it get heated too. Drake sore loser? He's suing UMG, saying they inflating Kendrick's numbers? Come on, man. The battle's over. <laughs> Yo, this is real. This is real. <laughs> Oh my God, bro. Oh my God, bro. Oh my God. This is absolutely real. I cannot believe this. Yo, I'm, I'm with the coach's feeling. I told y'all that this dude is not of the culture. I told y'all this is, yo, listen. This is elitism. This is where this is this is all everything that y'all was saying. All the all the Kendrick fans were saying about how how they how Drake is and how he is and how what I was saying. This is exactly what you get. This is exactly what y'all get, y'all Drake fans. This is what we've been telling y'all. We've been telling y'all this. This is exactly what y'all get. Look. Y'all, all y'all that defended this guy, and I see Maul, he's still defending him. Maul is still defending him. Let's go, man. Let it go. Let's get to the content. Yo, man, did this, this Drake really did this? He did. What'd he do? It's crazy. I filed a lawsuit on UMG spot. He did, this was crazy. And... I hate to say it, but dude crying like a little Cause now it's like, I'm seeing now how much damage this Kendrick Lamar did to him. Filed a lawsuit on UMG Spotify, talking about artificial inflating Kendrick Lamar's song. How you filed a lawsuit on his own record label? Filed, listen. He initiated legal action against UMG Spotify and the two companies conspired to artificially inflate the popularity of Kendrick Lamar's Not Like Us. And <laughs> the 
this nigga like, listen, bro, if I'm going down, I'm taking a whole ship down. <laughs> I don't care. If I'm going down, everybody going down. I'm taking everybody down, the whole record industry. I'm taking the whole record industry down. Everybody's going down if I'm going down. If he's going to, if y'all going to let him beat me like this, I'm going down. Everybody's going down. It's probably Monday, November 25th today, in a Manhattan court, Drake's frozen moment there. LC accused UMG of launching an illegal scheme involving bots, payola, and other methods to pump up Lamar's song, a track that savagely attacked Drake amid an ongoing feud between the two stars. Now, here go the thing. This where this risky at. The last nigga did this, they blackballed. His name was Six. Stop using ice in your ice bath. To cool your ice bath to 37 degrees, you'll need 169. 6'9. You remember when 6'9 came out and started exposing the bundles and this and that yeah. and this and that? Oh, yeah. And they wouldn't let I do that remember nigga that. make a playlist or yeah. nothing after that. I know because I, when I went to try to playlist him, they like, man, whack, you know the nigga, you know. Now, it's another thing. Damn. Can you ima Can y'all imagine? Can y'all imagine if the music industry was the black ball Drake? Can y'all imagine that? Because y'all do know that Drake doesn't own all his masters. He doesn't own his masters. At least I don't believe he owns his masters. But can you imagine that if he got blackballed? Can you imagine off of this battle, Drake, one of the biggest artists in the world, getting blackballed off of this battle. That's a, excuse me, that's another L. And I'm going to be honest with y'all, the way he's going, it might happen. It might end up happening. It might end up happening. This is crazy. This whole, this whole, yo, this, this whole battle it has to be the biggest and the craziest battle ever in hip hop history. This is still going on. The battle, <laughs> the battle was, was back in, the battle started, I believe in April. May was in, I think, I think May 4th was not like us, but the battle started in April. Uh, and I think it ended, not like us ended the battle. I believe not like us was April, uh, May 4th or something like that. But bro. It's still going on. This is still going on. I cannot believe this. It's still going on. And it's like so relevant. It ain't like, oh man, this battle, they battle. And it's like, nah, this is like they still, like they just dropped two songs yesterday. That's how relevant it is. It's crazy. Well, two more things. A, let's say they investigated. And it's found not to be true. Drake looking crazy, right? Exactly. Okay. Let's say they investigate it and find it to be true. What's next? Well, f it, nigga, let's check and see what was going on with your. Exactly. Hello. Hello. Oh my God, bro. That's a hundred percent facts. What happens when they find out what you were doing? What happens when they find out what you were doing? Like, it's unbelievable. This is unbelievable. I, I, I'm, I'm a loss of words. Like, I, you know, I, I always talk to on Drake. I always think that he's, he's the worst. But I've been telling y'all about this guy. But the more I think about it, the more I didn't do enough. I didn't tell y'all enough about him. This is crazy. Either way it go, this then let his emotions cloud his thoughts so bad to where he's just swinging in the air and screaming, and I'm going to be real. I think when he seen Kendrick Lamar controlling the first 12 slots of Apple, I think it sent him somewhere. I think that Kendrick can double. I was saying that earlier. I said... I think that him seeing Kendrick Lamar's songs all on Spotify like that and all on, uh, cause he had, Drake has no songs in the top 10. He don't have no songs on Billboard at all. 
And I think when he seen that, that might have that might have affected him. Remember, I told y'all on the other stream on the other video, I said something's gonna happen, and it happened today. Like, but I said something's gonna happen. Y'all gonna hear something, and look, this came out of nowhere. I I totally predicted that. This is crazy. This is crazy. Back and dropped a whole project since that, and he ain't released nothing. I think it's in him somewhere. Yeah, this he's emotional, <laughs> crazy. I'm like, either way it go, it's up for you. Before you gotta remember. They're not gonna go to trial. You, that you gotta remember, either. bro. Listen, listen, listen. Kendrick Lamar, right? Mm -hmm. Does not control what Spotify does. And here goes what's crazy. Absolutely not. He do not control what Spotify does. Kendrick Lamar, <laughs> excuse me. Kendrick Lamar don't control what Apple or Spotify does. Like, like what? Like, I, I'm, 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 I'm confused. Like, we'll see what happens. Let's keep it going. Spotify ain't gonna run no bot numbers up on themselves because they the ones gotta pay. Right. They, I, this yeah, that makes fan. sense. This That's nigga is more like are you like that said. This is the part that killed me. I couldn't believe it. He said. Spotify allegations that the two companies conspired to artificially inflate the popularity of Kendrick Lamar is not like us. Okay, Drake. <laughs> so when they got you on their playlist and got your picture up top, what the f you think that's doing for you? So I had to hit the team. I say, bro, they say wacky five. That's a fact. That's real. God damn. And then he, damn, bro, you fell off. Your your career is ruined, bro. After this, there's no coming back from this, bro. People, yo, people do not like people who take people to court, bro. They don't like that. I'm gonna tell you right now, your reputation is ruined, bro. And I don't think you understand that. I think you you I honestly think that you should have just let it go. And just said, you know what? I gave it to Kendrick. He got it. He won that battle. I'm moving on. I'm dropping some new hits. And just keep it going. And then Kendrick probably would have never said, not, said nothing to you ever again. And you would have did your thing. You probably would have still been making hits, doing whatever. But I never seen anybody fall from grace this fast and this hard after they were on top for so long and and to be honest with you i think that not like us knocked you off your pedestal and put you down i don't think it necessarily ended your career i know he smoked you he steamrolled you but your actions actually ended your career because i think not like us put you it put you in your place but you still had you had you still could people will still mess with you but i'm telling you when people find out this is going to spread like wildfire. When people find out that you did this, yeah, they're not going to mess with you like that. It's going to be a lot of people that's going to get turned off. A lot of your fans are going to be like, uh-uh, I can't deal with that dude like that. I can't. Yeah, he's wild for that. Yeah, so let's keep it going. How would you even be able to prove that? I don't know. What? I'm not commenting until I The people I that it, got it filed on them. I believe you that, that it's is real. real. I just ain't read what is what is the lawsuit. I haven't even read it. You, you, you ain't read, yo. Well, let Bro, some of y'all be some of y'all be reaching and y'all be knowing that certain things be happening, but y'all just don't want it to be happen happening to certain people. And y'all just wanna give people the benefit of the doubt, some people, but I just could never see I could never see Kendrick Lamar doing something like this. I can ask people, do you think Kendrick Lamar would have ever did something like this? I don't care what had happened. Do you think Kendrick Lamar would have ever did something like this? And what makes you think, and why do you think Drake did something like this? Do you think Drake really cares about whether the song's being pushed? How, how, how does that even look that you are, you are trying to sue somebody or sue or find out why the song was so popular? Like, I don't get it.
Let me read it for you. <laughs> Drake has it. initiated legal action against Universal Music Group and Spotify over allegations that the two companies conspired to artificially inflate the popularity of Kendrick Lamar's Not Like Us. In a filing Monday today, November 25th, at Manhattan Court, Drake's Frozen Moment LLC accused UMG of launching an illegal scheme involving bots, payola, and other methods to pump up Lamar's song, a track that savagely attacked Drake amid an ongoing feud between the two stars. 6 9 part two. Two things gonna happen. They go in there and can't find nothing, you looking crazy. Three head shaving tips that you're trying to shave flat surfaces, not They go in there, find something, and then look at your find something too, then what? Yeah, let's tell him. He says that, that whenever Siri, when people ask Siri to go to his song, it would take him to Kendrick's song. Huh? Uh, Girl, come on, bro. How you, how, somebody put that in there. I don't know if he said that. But how, you, how can you prove that? How can you prove something like that? Like how? If you say, uh, say I can't say it because it's going to activate, but <clears throat> like, how could you, how could, how could you prove that? You say this and then it plays that. Well, it could be that the algorithm plays what the most popular thing is when it comes to Certified Lover Boy. So if it says play Certified Lover Boy, it's probably going to play what the most popular uh, is on the, on the app. And Certified Lover Boy, Certified Pedophiles, wop, wop, wop. That, that's probably more popular than the album Certified Lover Boy. And my thing is, that album came out years ago, Drake. So even if you said when people ask to play that, it plays not like us. But it's probably going to play the most recent thing that Certified Lover Boy. I mean, there's plenty of times when I said, I told uh, <clears throat> Siri to play something and it played something totally different. Should I take Apple to court for that? Like, oh, no, nah, Apple. Y'all playing this, and I asked them to play Red Hot Chili Peppers, and it played Hot uh, hot Red Chili. Some group called Hot Red Chili. Like, no. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Um, I'm looking at some of the claims uh, from the lawsuit. So, they said whenever you ask Siri to That's play... That's Apple. Spotify ain't Apple, though, bro. That's this is the this is the lawsuit, so it must be they must be suing multiple uh, companies. Well, it's you UMG. Know you're controlling they, wait, no, 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 no. They're suing UMG. Right so they suing UMG. They they're claiming that UMG. UMG have, and Spotify. Uh, yeah, Both. UMC UMG paid Apple as well. So that's what they put. So, that's what's in there. So they're suing Apple too. Yeah. Well, I guess under the UMG paid them umbrella, but yeah. Well, I, well, I guess because he sees Kendrick's first 12 songs is controlled the top 12 on Apple. Maybe that's what did him. <laughs> Yo, I'm telling you, bro, something's going to happen. I'm telling you, and I hope it's not bad. Get this thing. I, I'm, bro, it's like you pouting. Well, Apple is not na It does say, though, it does make it clear, he, although he is doing that, Apple is not named as the respondent in the petition or accused of anything wrong. So we're not suing Apple. No, but he's accusing UMG of uh, paying to have its voice assistant feature purposely misdirect users. That's from this lawsuit Man, that you I... you can't prove that. How can you... First of all, you can't even do that. How can... So you're basically saying... This, this is so crazy how people... I don't think he's doing this, but this is so crazy how Drake thinks or whoever is in his camp thinks you're seeing that umg paid apple to manipulate C that woman to manipulate that woman to basically uh <laughs> play not like us like what how does that sound that's crazy Read it. um I'll bro i'm gonna be fun. real bro if i'm looking <laughs> for a hey, pull up ll cool j right and Run DMC come on, I'm going to say pull up LL Cool J. But then you just gave a stream to the LL Cool That's J. That's not a stream, bro. You can't. Siri don't give you no stream. No, you, you say play, play. No, 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 no. If you say play this song, it's going to play it. What does that you mean? You're talking about on Apple. That, mean yeah. that don't mean nothing. If you say play a song and it's not the right song, then you just, do you say, um, hey, and you say it again, and then it plays the right song. What are you trying to say? You trying to say that that 
If this song comes on and everybody requests it a hundred times after that, no, they'll say okay. But I, that's that. I don't know. He don't know what he's talking about. That dude don't know what he's talking about. You tell your Apple phone, hey, Apple Play, Blueface, Tatiana. So he's saying it only did it then and don't do it now. Say, like <laughs> I did see some some little <laughs> things, but I ain't. No, I'm not getting. I don't. I can't balance it. No, you didn't, bro. You get that's cap, bro. That's cap. No, you didn't. You ain't seen nothing like that. You ain't never seen nothing like that. That's cat, bro. You just saying that because you just want to be right. That's cat. That's no. crazy. Man. I can't validate the claim, but I did see some some things similar to like you know how they was talking about the whole voting shit where you click on something it was going the other way. I seen people post about this doing that, but I thought that was just fans fanning. Drake fans. Yeah, I thought that was Drake fans doing the doing the oh you I know can't fans. That nigga, that nigga really did that shit. I can't believe. He, I yeah, thought I, he was a UMG artist. <laughs> that's that's what I'm saying. Like, that's what I'm confused. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to tell you, bro. Hey, bro, I'm going to tell you what I Drake hope it don't said, happen. Dude. But I think this going to be some Diddy Part 2 shit. Oh, I see what's happening. I swear happening. I was thinking that. Uh, He's saying that once, once they went to UMG, UMG said Lamar did it and not them. So now he's saying that it was U UMG. Okay, I'm peeping what he's saying. Okay. He said what? They suing. They're not keep suing Kenny Lamar. He said when he said um okay. That's the one Drake Spotify, UMG. Yeah, because he says that once he once he said that it was LaRong doing when he approached UMG, when he pointed the finger. Wait, no, no, it says Drake says UMG has pointed the finger at Lamar and insisted that Drake should sue his rival rather than the label. He also claims that UMG told told him that the label would sue Lamar if Drake ended up winning his own lawsuit. How the hell are you going to sue Kendrick Lamar when, well, nigga, he's not the distributor? Uh, that's just this lawsuit. <laughs> that, this, that's this uh this this billboard link you just posted. Yeah, that's some right? bullshit because he's not the distributor. Paying your bills on time raises your credit credit score. Uh, how yeah, how are artists gonna yeah, make it? I'm gonna be honest though. That. If if this nigga sues Kendrick for one, there's no question who won at this point. But two, <laughs> nigga, it was no question before. You I know. <laughs> nah, but like, <laughs> it wasn't no question before. Like, come on, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to have to call, call down to the camp, bro. I don't know what's Still going denial, on right now. My nigga. I don't know what's going on right now. I, to, be, to be honest, I don't support this at all. I don't support this movement at all. I don't see nah, what... Nah, the spy saying it don't play when you say that. It just puts you in the algorithm. What you mean? I'm going to... You go... If you say play, what you call it? On Apple? Yeah. Would they play it? Hell yeah. Yeah, play what? It's definitely say, playing it. Say, play not like us. Series. Uh-huh. Play not like us by Kendrick Lamar. Now playing not like us. Single okay. by Kendrick Lamar on Apple Music. You can always ask me to switch to a different app. Your choices will help me learn the ones you like. See what I'm saying? So... You saying when they was asking to play Drake. It says specifically certified lover boy. When you said that, that it took it to uh not like us. But the thing is, you gotta play, you gotta ask for the artist. You gotta say, hey, sit play Drake certified lover boy. You can't say play certified lover boy. Hey, play certified lover boy, because it's probably a hundred million certified lover boys inside of the algorithm. You know what I'm saying? You have to say the artist's name. Oh, okay, that makes on, sense, bro. though. Hold on, bro. Oh, that go ahead, Wax. Sorry. Oh, it do. See, that ain't what you said a minute ago. Yeah, yeah that, that makes sense. When you say a Drake yeah, song. Yeah, that do make sense. Drake, that's a Drake album. That's exactly what I just but said. But Kendrick Lamar. Cool. Nah, that's 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 from a no, that's a Kendrick that song. Yeah, that's, that's a kid, bro. Brock, that ain't what the bar. Said. What you said was when they when you asked Siri to play the Drake song, it was playing not certified like lover boy is Drake. Nah, certified no. lover boy is a bar. 
No, it's a bar. That's a bar. It's, it's hey, still bro. not gonna break up. Not like it us says if you when you ask the hey, album to play yeah. certified lover boy by. Hey, you, you, you know, you know, it's right, 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 but it's a, it's, it's an old line, song and it is more no popular. Song, nigga, that's no, an album. Let's oh, certify album. album. But we can't just say that. We just, when we just asked yeah. it, when we just ask it, it played Drake. Uh, when you said yep. certified lover boy, you said play Drake. Yeah, that's 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 his shit. That's what that's his, his shit, do. shit. My nigga, what yeah. are we talking about? I don't even. There's no debate. But what are we but about? even if yeah, it's but, Kendrick, it makes sense. Uh, Two year olds. Yeah, it makes sense with Kendrick line. because Kendrick got that line in that song. So that's yeah. 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 Saying that line's not even... gonna. <laughs> nigga said, "Man, two year olds be saying that line." <laughs> wah 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 wah. <laughs> All right, man. Let's listen to a little more, and we out of here. Oh, oh though. Certified Lover Boy. This shit is called Certified Lover Boy. The album, the album called CLB, what? His uh, Drake album called Certified Lover Boy. No, but the song that comes on uh -huh. is, is Ch Champagne Poetry. Oh, I think that's number one. It might be the intro of this. If it's yeah, that might be the intro of the most popular right song. Now. You're playing an album, so the first song is playing from the album. No, that makes sense too, but... So how are they going to be able to bro? Regardless, y'all, this is all digital. They're gonna get the digital yeah. police in there. There's a receipt for everything that was That's done, okay. and and they're gonna they're gonna find if there out. Was a, if there was a program in, hey, Weezy Champagne yeah. Poetry. That's number one on CLB. That's why that one come first. Cause that's the yeah. intro. Hey, but bro, adjustments, anything you do online has a receipt. There's a timeline. There's something. So. There, there yeah, are receipts. Yeah. No, but what we're saying is that was such a popular line. Absolutely. That no, I can I just, I'm with y'all. No, 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 no. It said hey, we but hold on, bro. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Algorithm. I got it you. I got you, bro. The album certified. I got you. There's that no album by Kendrick named Certified Lover Boy, so it shouldn't have popped up. That's enough. People going to talk over each other. But yeah, man. Yeah, this is this is a sad day in music, and y'all already know how I feel about Doodle Ball. But just thinking about him doing something like that is crazy. Cause I say, if, even if he find out, somebody's gonna investigate you. It's gonna be the same outcome. So what's the point of you doing that? Like, if it if it pans out, but I don't know. All right, man, I'm out of here. Y'all have yourself a good night, man. See y'all people.